Uh oh. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today we're fishing the Middle Chattahoochee River drainage. And I'm wearing waders. It's actually winter now, but that's, that's not the only reason I'm wearing waders. We're actually fishing a large stream, as you can see, and the water temps are, are low. The target species will be the shoal bass and the largemouth, but there are uh, spotted bass in this section in the middle Chattahoochee. chunky largemouth on the flipping tube. There's one. Little shoal bass. Got the red eyes, so that's probably a male. Not a big fish, but it's the first shoal bass. Look at his eyes, they're, they're no longer red. That's interesting. Beautiful fish. See you, buddy. Caught that fish on a uh, Lucky Craft pointer, the 78 size, which really, uh, this is the chartreuse shad color other companies call it a sexy shad color but really does a, a really good job of imitating a threadfin shad which are uh, washing out of a lot of the dams right now across the southeast This is a, a little non-native spotted bass here. And these are, most of the fish down in this part of the drainage are actually real spotted bass. Micropterus punctulatus. He's got some red there on his, his upper tooth patch and inside of his mouth is red. That's actually from the uh, cooler water temps. You see that a lot in the winter. It is winter now. Uh, when the water gets down into the 40s and low 50s in some areas, you'll see that in a lot of the black bass. And it's just uh, from the cooler water temps. But that's a, that's a spotted bass. 
not an Alabama bass. A lot of people call Alabama bass spotted bass, but this is a true spotted bass. Uh oh. Stay hooked. Stay hooked, fish. It's not a giant, but it's a nice one. There he is, a couple pounds, probably 16 inches or so, 17 maybe. Just a nice chunky shoal bass. Chunky largemouth spray and milt. So that's a male. Really surprised to see these fish spray and milt, but that's obviously got a lot of lot to do with the temperature, uh, the weather we've had, and the, the water temperature. I think it's triggered by water temp more than the uh, spawn, but uh, I could be wrong about that. But get him back in the water. There's a good one. Well, it was a good one. Looked like a four and a half pound largemouth. This fish just figured out it was hooked. It's not a giant, but it's it's a nice shoal bass. Hopefully this one stays hooked. It is barely hooked in the corner of the mouth.
There we go. This fish has been caught before, probably multiple times. That's a nice shoal bass. Probably three and a half pounds. It's, it's, it's long, but it's uh, kind of an old looking fish. Pretty beat up. And uh, it's Maxilla, it's torn on this side. You can see it's been caught before. So I'm gonna get uh, this old fish back in the water here. Probably three and a half pounds, I'm guessing. See ya.